guys so before i start the video do you ever like want if any of y'all make videos i don't know who makes videos of my subscribers but like i make videos obviously obviously i make videos wow wow kill me anyways so like my videos like at the very end and I, I was just filming the how does one longboard story time and um at the end I was just like subscribe like subscribe today like hit that button down below and I was so close if you know who graveyard girl to be like hit that hit, uh subscribe today hit that button down below and become a member of the swamp family and give an alligator its wings like I do that shit I'm like I've said what up in a video and like been so close to me like what up fox fam but <laughs> <laughs> worthless stuff no one cares about okay so today I'm gonna throw a little bit of shade on one of my favorite places establishments in the world which is Starbucks I'm so fucking white so basic white girl right now like but here's the thing so I just finished my ninth grade year and on Fridays since I went to a school that wasn't the like zoned high school so we would get out a little bit later from regular high school and get dropped off at the intermediate school rather than getting dropped off at the zoned high school but on Fridays we got out early and we did get picked or picked up we did get dropped off at the zoned high school and so Obviously, I knew a lot of people there. I had a whole bunch of friends who didn't go to the same school as me who went to the zoned high school. And so, which is where I'm going there next year, but whatever. And so we would all go on Fridays whenever, like, me and, like, my friend group that knew everyone from the school that I came, that like, my zoned school. Um, we would all go to Starbucks together because it was right across the street. And so one of my close friends she's been in a few of my videos um bunny so me and her were like yeah like we're gonna actually go buy something inside and so i have the i had i don't have it anymore but i had the like starbucks gift cards that you would put in money on and then you could use the app and pay with your phone if you didn't have the card and so that day while i was at school they ran an update and i saw the update and i was just like uh oh because every time in the past whenever i would update it it would make me like try to like log in like start a new account and i'm trying like trying and it was just a hassle for me to get logged back in to the other account it would be really annoying and so it was really frustrating. I was hoping that wouldn't be a problem and i checked right when it, and it pulled up my regular stuff but when we got to starbucks we walked in and we're waiting in line um, Bunny was in front of me, and I was gonna buy her a drink too. I was she wanted a caramel frappuccino. I wanted a caramel frappuccino, so I was just gonna buy us two caramel frappuccinos and go on with my day. I didn't have the actual card with me because I didn't carry the card around because I had it on my app. I couldn't log into the app because it wasn't working once like later that day, and so I, I was gonna just go up to there and be like, hey, like my Starbucks app. It logged me out whenever they were in the update. Do you know how to fix it? Because I figured, you know, they work at Starbucks. They'd probably know how it works. And she was just like, no, I don't know. Like, that sucks. And I was like, oh, okay, well, I'll just go stand over here um, and, until I fix it. That way other people could go on the line. And so the next people order. And I'm standing there still trying to fix it, like, looking down at my phone. And the motherfucking barista had the fucking audacity to mock me to one of her other colleagues in front of my face why like she goes she walks over and she's like and she like tries to whisper but like didn't whisper like i don't know if she didn't realize i was there or she was just doing it to be a complete bitch um um and she's just like she leans over to the other barista that was working and was just like, it was just like, oh, they locked me out of the Starbucks at me. And it like, was like mocking me and shit. And I'm just like. And Bunny heard this too. And Bunny was like, Liz, don't make a scene in the Starbucks. And I was like, this bitch. And then I look up at her and I go, want to say it to my face? And I said it at like the, like the loudest tone. <laughs> Like, I, my friend, like, Bunny was so embarrassed. Like, she was, th like, so this far mad, like, mad at me. Because I made a scene. And she's like, don't make a scene. Don't make a scene. We're going to get kicked out. Like, don't make a scene. And shit. 
And I was just like, no, like, she's being a fucking bitch. Like, don't be a fucking bitch. I'm your little customer. If you're going to talk shit, at least go into your fucking, like, back kitchen area and talk shit. Damn, it's not that hard. And so I was like, want to say it to my face? And the other girl just like. And then the, and then the girl who was mocking me was just like, like, looked right at me like, like, oh, shit, you heard me say that. And just turned around and walked into the back room. And I was like. And so I just tell the other barista and I was just like, can I just get a glass of water? Cause I am like a cup of water um, because I can't figure the Starbucks up out. And she's like, she's like, keep it in between you and me, but I'm going to get you like, I'll, I'll make you both drinks. And so she made us both drinks and that was pretty chill. But that other bitch just fucking pissed me off. But yeah. And she was like, I saw her cause we usually go and we just hang out like the group of us. They have like this little covered patio area in between like two buildings where we could sit and so we just sat, sit there and all hang out and stuff and one of our other friends would go like to get this pizza place that was across the street get us all pizza we'd sit there drink starbucks chat with friends eat pizza you know and so we were probably there i got there around like 2 45 and i didn't leave that night till like five because i i was like the last one to leave just because I knew I was walking and so I just wanted to hang out with everyone because like my parents were could come and get me up and they didn't care what time I came home. So I just was hanging out and I guess there's like some kind of like shift change around four because it was around four and I saw her leave and stuff and she's just sitting out there like waiting for a ride and she's sitting in the patio like three tables over and my entire friend group's just like this bitch this bitch like a boy. Don't get me started. But yeah, so that was like a shit show. And that was like the beginning of this, like not like the beginning of the school year, but the beginning of 2016. And we would go there every single Friday until like school ended, we would go. And so she didn't always work, but there'd be like a rare chance that I would see her. And I'd just be like, hmm. And she'd be the one at the register, and I'd be like, hi, how are you doing today? And she'd be like, good, you know, the fake-ass fucking bitch smile on her face. Yeah. I never really ranted about this, and I kind of wanted to rant about it, but, yeah, I don't know. I was just, like, brainstorming on, like, like, the words. I was just brainstorming on, like, video ideas and things that I wanted to tell you guys. And that was something that I wrote down. So I thought I would tell you guys because I thought it was pretty funny. So, yeah. Alrighty, guys. So, yeah. I will see you next time. Remember to hit the button down below and subscribe. And, as always... I will see you next.